guys. I'm so depressed. And I don't know what to do in my life. I know. I'm going to get some life advice from TikTokers. What? <laughs> Getting everyone rich. Oh, hell yeah, bro. You're going to guide me to make six figures? What? $200 to teach me how to make AirPods a reselling guide. How to make how to make 50,000 by okay, selling AirPods. You'll get a step-by-step -step access to marketing hacks. You guys can hack the market. You can hack the mainframe, Tronic. So wait, 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 wait. Let me get the big good. Let me get this straight. Let me get this straight. Let me get this straight. I have to buy all these products. Mind you, I'm broke as it is already. Okay, I have to buy all of these products. Okay, you're gonna give charge me 200, 150, and 55. Um, you're gonna charge me for that. So that's 405. You're gonna charge me 405. Okay, on top of it, you're gonna charge me 405 to teach me how to sell these. What if I don't sell them? Then I have fucking a shit ton of shoes, a shit ton of AirPods. And I don't gain a profit? Well, then I'm out of money, man. Secret number three, and the most important, most weird that you're probably not gonna implement because you're too soft for this. Do not let her burn the conversation to the ground. But like, it's it it is not the answer. answer. Guess what? Most guys don't do it. Most guys don't do it. And then she doesn't reply to you. What? Most guys don't understand what the fuck just happened. Because I don't understand what you just fucking said. <laughs> Hey, mom, pulling up in your bullshit fucking Corolla, and I pull up in my McLaren, it's not even- Alright, buddy. <laughs> you know, you don't have to go after me directly. <laughs> I'm sorry to tell you this, but you're fucking stupid. All that pre work Wow. <laughs> bro. <laughs> yeah, dude, you're fucking stupid, bro. You're driving a fucking Corolla, bro. Get the fuck out of here, Alex. Come on, Alex. Bro, he, went, he, went, he went directly for me, bro. <laughs> I'm pulling up in my Batmobile. You're not gonna win that battle. She's gonna go with me. What are you fucking clashing each other's car at each other? <laughs> a lot of chicks. Would you rather go to college or would you rather make 10K a month? That's the- What type of fucking question is that? <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Maybe, maybe he has more no, explanation to do because that's just the very vague as shit. <laughs> Okay. Question you have to ask yourself, right? Do you go to college, four years, bang a lot of chicks, drink a lot, have a lot of fun, right? That's cool for people young like you. Or do you go take a laptop, learn a high ticket skill, and make 10K a month? What? Wait, what's the skill? What are you gonna show me? If not, bro, I'm just gonna go to college and bang some chicks. <laughs> what the hell is this shit, man? You are 20 to 35 years old. And you are lost, confused, addicted to some kind of vice like alcohol, Netflix, TikTok. I'm going to tell you why it is you are the way you are. Here's the simple answer. You disconnect. You are extremely dis... Oh, wait, 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 wait. I forgot to plug myself in. Oh, shit. My fault, my fault, my fault. Hold up. Where's my snatching cord? Okay. All right, all right. I'm connected. From who you truly are and what you are truly here to do. You were raised by adults yeah. who actively worked against you being who you truly are and what you are here to truly do. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You know what this reminds me of? If you watch any anime or show, bro, whenever they're born, it's like, I was born to do this. But in this sense, you're supposed to know what we're born to do. Like, you know, when we came out of the room, we're like, all right, here, you're going to be a, a target worker and be broke as shit. Sign here. Got you, bam. Like... <laughs> <laughs> our best, we, we still not done. And the yet. reason why this is all relevant to you now is okay, wait, wait, because wait. your only salvation uh -huh. to a life where you feel confident in what you're doing uh -huh. and who you are. Uh -huh. Your <clears throat> only salvation yeah. is to dive deep into the pit of the unknown, the pit of your unconscious, huh? and start to illuminate your shadow. You have to do. Uh, wait, shadow meditation. clone Jutsu? Is that what I'm supposed to do? No, no. You have to. You have to do meditation. That's oh. what you have to do. Psychedelics. Oh. Psychedelics. <laughs> child hearing <laughs> therapy. Some weed, Alex. Or even just picking the- Whenever you are. Whenever you are. I'll be dead when I'm eight years old. <laughs> Take the moment just to who you truly are right now. That was terrible advice. <laughs> <laughs> he went on for two minutes. Three- No. Almost three minutes. He went on for three minutes. Saying the same thing over and over again. You need to dive into the unknown, bro. Just get, just get your scuba deer and just dive in, bro. Yep. Bro, Make sure you take them psychedelics. You know, it reminded me of that one friend. That one friend that you're just having, a, you know, you're venting to, right? And then they just make it all about themselves. <laughs> it's 
Like just I... start trauma dumping. <laughs> if you've had a bad night of sleep, the advice, and I learned this from my wonderful colleague Michael Perlis, do nothing. What I mean by that is, don't wake up any later, don't sleep in the following day to try and make up for it. Don't nap during the day. Don't consume extra caffeine to wake you up, to try to get you through the day. And don't go to bed any earlier to think that you're going to compensate. And I can explain all of those things, but if you wake up later, you're not going to be sleepy until later the evening. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, no, go back. No, 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 no. What the fuck? Wait, you just explain if you go to bed later, you wake up later. It, that's science. What? Wait, that's not hot. Uh, what? Do you not know what sleep de depth is? <laughs> He's still interested in them and likes them just enough to respond. And to the insecure guy, that response is everything. It makes or breaks his whole day. Yeah, that's just an insecure guy. <laughs> Text women? Insecure. I need to learn more about, like, what am I doing wrong? What am I doing wrong with women, man? You know? Let's see. Stop chasing women. Pursue them instead. Pursuing women is... What? <laughs> it's the first one. <laughs> is when you intelligently use your time, tension, money, and energy to invest in a woman you have a good chance of getting into a relationship with and Oh wait, I wasn't just supposed to stand a text saying I want him down the fuck? Oh shit. Uh, I guess man. not. Shit, uh, I guess man. not. Fuck! Man, damn. Ah, uh, dang, I've been doing it wrong this whole Yo, time. Man, bro, shit, man. So you have a chance of getting with her if you invest your time, money, and attention, but you have a chance of not getting her. Yeah. Okay, makes sense. Got it. Relationship with in the hopes that doing all of these things will make her I just like, can't win. Prime example yeah, man. of chasing women is buying only fit, investing <laughs> all of <laughs> Where did that come from? <laughs> <laughs> we just did a 180, bro. Dude. Obviously, bro. The girl I fucking subscribe to on OnlyFans is gonna fucking date me, bro. Obviously. What? What? Why Why else would I buy it, bro? So you're texting a girl, she stops responding, and you start thinking, shoot, what did I do wrong? Here's two reasons why she won't text you back. Number one, she's dating someone else. This one is more common than you think. Most girls are never... <laughs> well, if... <laughs> she's dating someone else... <laughs> Why am I going for her? <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Okay. Virtually single. There's always a guy or two in their orbit who's one date away from becoming their next boyfriend or situationship. If she won't respond, chances are you were a little too late and she went all in on chat. Number two. Okay. <laughs> See, that's where you lost all respect from me. <laughs> You, you said Chad and put that clip into your video. <laughs> this is not ironically. Is this not satire? This is, there's no fucking way this is. Oh, it's, he actually believes this because he has a course. Okay. Yeah. No, this is not. This is, this is not satire. This is. <laughs> this is sad, is what it is. <laughs> okay, number two. Alex, you didn't fall in category number one. Number two. I'm, I didn't. Two. You said something that didn't warrant a response. So. <laughs> Hey, you want to hang? Like just... <laughs> hey, you want to hang out at seven? Okay. Damn it, bro! I fucking messed up the response, man. <laughs> if you can't even muster up the courage to go up and approach a girl and say hi, then why would she respect you, and why would she ever give you the time of day? I... You know when you say something that's basic common knowledge, and you're trying to make yourself sound so much more intelligent? This guy's your example. Hey man, I like this girl, man. I don't know if she likes me back, and I'm not gonna ask her. So, uh, yeah, she doesn't like me. You see, you see, see, see when I say something yeah. out loud that just sounds so common knowledge that, we're, we, well, we, we just went to, hey, how are you? Just like, hey, get on the bed. Like, 